Hey, my name is Phil from agencyautomation.co. In today's video, we're gonna be talking about how you can white label, go high level, very quickly, very easily, so you have your own white labeled brand where you can resell the go high level SaaS services. Now, if it's your first time on this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And if you haven't yet, make sure you smash like if you get value from this video. So what we're going to be doing today is I'm going to show you how you can exactly connect your own domain to go high level. So then when your clients that you get into your white labeled go high level business want to log in, this is the login port that they're going to go to. Now, just before I get started, if you haven't yet got started with go high level and you're thinking about it, I've got a exclusive 30 day free trial link in the description that you can go ahead and get access to plus i also give you a bonus course that's going to have four parts to it which is going to teach you how to get more traffic into your business how to get set up really quickly how to make great funnels and also how to make money as an affiliate so go ahead once again check that out and you'll get those bonuses Okay, so let's go ahead and get started with this training. The first thing you're going to want to do is have access to where your domain is currently being hosted, if it's either on uh, Go High Level Servers or if it's hosted on a domain registrar like GoDaddy or Namecheap, or if you have a website on top of it, wherever that domain is hosted. For me, I am currently having it hosted on a uh, shared hosting panel, which has got cPanel inside of it. So that's where I'm going to show you how you can get into it however i will also link to a video in the description where you can see inside of here alternative ways how to do it as well so what we're going to be doing is very simple very quick and very easy what we want to do is come down to settings and then we want to come across to company and then inside of company, this is where you're gonna be white labeling go high level. So the first thing you wanna do is change the logo. So I'm gonna go ahead and change it now, right? So I've just uploaded a logo. So in a few seconds, it's going to appear. And if it doesn't appear for just a second, just switch over to profile and back to company. And then it should appear there. I maybe didn't refresh the page properly, but regardless, it is there now. And to check if it's actually worked in the top left of your page, you should now have your logo displaying there, which is cool, uh, which means it's all looking good and dandy. It's probably not the best colors I chose for this particular brand, but regardless, it is there. So when we come down, what you want to do is fill out your company website like so, so people know exactly what your website is. But then for the white label domain, just before that, this is where we're going to add in our subdomain so that our users can log directly into the platform, which is going to be white labeled with our brand. So what you want to do is type in um, the most common is app or login or members or things like that. But I like app and then put your domain. So I'm not putting www again. I'm just replacing it with app. And then that is pretty much good to go. What you need to do now though is come and click on this little button here, which is going to open this new page, given new instructions. And what we need to do is copy this little uh, this little website URL here, app.messengersender.com. Message sender.com, I believe it might be. This is the go high level white label sort of platform. So what we need to do now is log into our domain registrar or our hosting platform. We need to come onto um, the platform and look for zone editor or DNS. And this is gonna be where you can add in different uh, elements to your website. So go ahead, click on that. And then what we're looking for is the place to add in a CNAME record. If you don't see a CNAME record area, you can also click on manage or zone editor or something like that. So what I'm going to do is click on manage. I'm going to show you it manually because you're probably going to see this panel more than the other ones. So what I'm going to do is click on add record. There's also a drop down and I'm going to choose add CNAME record. And then what we want to do now is type in um, app right so we're trying to create an app subdomain and then we want to paste in the record here which was copied from the instructions over there so once again you only have to put an app it should auto fill if it requires it so that's all good and then once you've done that click add record and this is now propagating i believe it's called propagating so it's going to take maybe 10 minutes it could take two minutes it could take two hours depending on where your domain is hosted is going to depend on how long it takes but what you will see is if you come back to this here, you just come down, click on update company, and it's saying it couldn't find it. So what I'm gonna do is pause the video, time how long it takes, and I'm just gonna keep trying every minute and give you an idea of how long it took for me. 
Okay, so it took less than like a minute, probably about 30 seconds. And if I go to my web address now, we see we can log into our account. And you can tell this is a Go High Level account because of this little logo here. And this will change as well in a little bit, but just for now in the login page, that's what it looks like. Now the last step we need to do is at the moment, if you hover over the terms and conditions down the bottom, it's going to, you can see in the bottom left, the Go High Level website. What we want to do is actually add in our own privacy policy or terms and conditions page. And it's really simple to do. So what I'm going to do is come back to our dashboard and it says a privacy policy URL, but it links to terms and conditions. So if you have a terms and conditions page, I probably recommend linking it to that instead. So I'm going to put in here, intactmedia.co.nz forward slash terms and conditions right go ahead click on update company once again and now if i refresh this page one more time you can see the logos here so it's a little bit big i'll probably change it i didn't actually scale it to their recommendations here but regardless it's still working so i'm happy and if we hover over this link now you can see in the bottom left it takes us to our own terms and conditions so it is very uh, quick and easy to white label go high level in fact it took probably about five minutes even less to get this done and it's all ready to rock and roll once i start getting some new customers into my sas um, white labeled version of go high level they will now log in using this link they're going to see my brand there and then inside the dashboard is also going to be my brand so it's very quick very easy and hopefully you've set up all your pricing plans so you're ready to start collecting some new clients if you've missed out my last video i show you how to actually create a, a in a funnel for the sas mode so you want to do that so you can set up your pricing plans you can set up a nice web page things like that and all of the other bits that go with it so once again if you enjoyed this video if you got value from it make sure you smash that thumbs up button if you want to keep up to date with some more go high level tutorials hit that subscribe button and if you haven't got started yet make sure you grab those bonuses i mentioned earlier linked to that in the description but apart from that i hope you enjoyed the video and i look forward to seeing you on the next one